Hi and welcome to another Type With Me. In today's video I want to talk about TypeSync. Install missing typings. So we have Jest and we have RimRef and we have Moments. Right? So now I'm going to show you how you can use TypeSync. Well, you can very easily use TypeSync with MPX TypeSync. Of course, then you don't need to install it, but you can just use it there, right? And it says no new typings added. Looks like you're all synced up. So apparently all the typings are within just moment and RimRef uh, packages. And I'm going to show you now how you can also see that, right? So if you go to npm and you search for moment, you see here uh, ts, and it says that this package contains built-in TypeScript declarations. I'm gonna search for lodash. So lodash will give me this, right? And you see here that we have TypeScript declarations and they are provided by at times slash lodash. But imagine that you don't know that. Well, we are going to install first lodash and then we are going to do the type sync again. So like you can see here, lodash is in our package.json file. So if we now ring run npx type sync again, you will see that you will detect lodash and he says one new typings added zero unused typings removed add types slash lodash and now he says go ahead and run npm install to install the packages so we're going to do that as well i didn't know that this was not included but okay i think it's normal um, and now he's just installing it, right? And now we have that as well in our project. So for me, it's really a nice tool to use um, just to see, okay, are there typings? And uh, install them just for me on your project so that you don't need to look into it and search for typings all the way around, right? So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you're gonna use TypeSync as well. Uh, and please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe to my channel if you want to get more insights on TypeScript, web development, and other cool stuff. Thank you very much. See you next time.